Oh my, take a look at this one. Especially you Chevelle fans. One of the best years in my opinion. 1967 Chevrolet Chevelle. Two-door hardtop here. Absolutely gorgeous car. This car is nicer than GM would have made it. I can guarantee you that. I'm going to take you in a little walk around here and show you some of the things I've come across on this. Beautiful build. First off, this car is a little over 3,000 miles since it was built. And it definitely shows. And it was a quality build. Like I said, I'll point out some of the things I've noticed. I'll go through a little cheat sheet I got here. Tell you about this car. As you can see, bumpers, bright work. Beautiful. Majority of it is all new or re-chromed. Any of it that needed to be freshened up was done. Same as the uh, simulated hood vents. Those are also new or all redone. The color that you see on here is from a 2015 GM color. It's actually blue velvet metallic paint. And that's what it looks like. It looks like blue velvet. It is just dropped it gorgeous. The pictures and video, I hate to say it, don't do this car justice. Uh, speaking of pictures, if you want to go and check those out when you're done with this video and you want to see the still pictures, check out the underside. Check out just the stainless exhaust on this thing, the floor pans. The underside of this car is as nice as the interior, the engine bay, the top of it. Check out those still pictures, uniqueclassiccars.com. If you want to cut to the chase, you want to own this car, our phone number is 507-386-1726. Don't be afraid to call. <laughs> You'll be happy you did when you get this car. So, paint, blue velvet metallic off 2015 GM. Interior is also redone in kind of a medium blue vinyl. As you can see, it's got buckets up front where you see these shadows right here. That's the way my lighting is. And it also does it on the floor, that line across there. That is the lighting. It, there's no fading, no two-tone, nothing like that. It's just the way the light is coming through the window um, off that sun visor tinted sunshade up there in the windshield. Just to give you an idea, I haven't come across much for blemishes in this car at all. As you can see, riding on chrome five spoke wheels. The rubber is good on it. How about under the hood? I suppose you're wondering what's underneath there. What if I told you there's a 454? gen 6 block underneath there with efi power steering power brake serpentine belt system air conditioning like i said this one's probably a little bit nicer than even gm did back in the day guarantee it dries out more like a resto mod's going to than a stock car this is not originally an ss chevelle although it's been done up badging it. everything as an ss it is a 136 vin code car so we know it is not an, a true ss but hey, with what's been done to this and how it's been resto modded and the stuff that's been done, it's as nice as resto mod as we have seen in here. Take again a look at the uh, rear bumper, rear bright work again. If it needed to be rechromed or needed to be done or needed new, it got it. In those still pictures, check out the trunk, how the trunk is finished off in this car. I'll let you go to take a look at the still pictures because I want you to see the underside of it too. Again, still pictures, uniqueclassiccars.com. Hey, we welcome third-party inspectors. Don't want to take my word for it on this. Don't want to take the pictures. You want a third-party inspector, schedule it, send them on in. Don't have a problem with third-party inspectors at all. We also can assist with transportation. Financing is available, and we would consider trades in this beauty. All right, let's just go down this cheat sheet a little bit, tell you what's new on this car. New carpeting, new seat covers, new door panels. Tires, wheels. Engine has hydraulic roller lifters, by the way. Edelbrock intake, new water pump, new aluminum radiator, uh, new electric fans and that. Does have the vintage air, like I mentioned before. Dakota digital analog instrument cluster, I'm going to show you, is absolutely beautiful in this car. And then that is also matched up with a Pioneer Bluetooth stereo system, speaker and amps. And the cool part about it is all the readouts are in blue. It just sets this car off every little detail when this car was built is either for a nice purpose as far as driving or for a great appearance this car i would take to any show not be afraid to show this car roll-ins cruise-ins just out for a drive 
that 454 I mentioned underneath the hood that is paired with an automatic transmission with overdrive. So this car, you can get it, take it down the interstate and drive it. See the B&M shifter on the floor there. Um, has new disc brakes up front, a new windshield. Uh, like I said, bumpers, grill, hood, all new, those hood louvers. Most of the exterior trim has all been gone through on this car. Does have an I did it steering column with tilt. And I mentioned it has a serpentine system. That's a March Performance serpentine system underneath the hood. Tell you what, let's go ahead and fire this up so you can hear what this thing sounds like. Like I said, it is an EFI car. Turn the key. Here's the fuel pump. Now check that out too. Like I said, how the dash is, reads out in blue. There's how many miles since the build, 3,400. That stereo system I was talking about matches up nicely. Let's fire it up. I'm gonna let it sit and idle and warm up a little bit. Slip around to the back so you hear it. And just look at how that door closes and fits. Nice little rumble at idle. You get on the throttle of this thing, and you'll know it. If you like to pull into your local rolling or show with this beauty. You definitely turn some heads with the sound and the sight, so to speak. Let's go ahead, I'm going to pause this and open this hood so you can check out this engine bay. Alright, here you go. Like I said, just as nice as the rest of the car. Aluminum radiator, power steering, power brake, vintage air, HX454, like paired up with that. Automatic transmission and overdrive. This car is made to go down the highway. All directions on it. There you have it, 1967 Chevelle. I call it a Resto Mod. Like the fans kicked on. Give us a call, 507 386 1726. Still pictures, unique, classic cars.com. And of course, we do consider trades. Financing is available. We can help with the transportation of this to where you're located at. Give us a call.